horrible news shakes up Elvis estate biopic of Priscilla Presley. The relationship between Elvis and Priscilla Presley, their marriage, and their divorce will all be covered in the upcoming Hollywood movie. The Elvis estate, meanwhile, has denounced the movie as horrible and like a college movie, despite the star's ex-wife hailing it as masterful and based on her memoir. The new movie Priscilla, directed by Oscar-winning director Sofia Coppola, explores the relationship of the pair from their first encounter to their divorce. Flashes of Priscilla's life with the chart-topper, famed for singles like Jailhouse Rock, Suspicious Minds, and Hound Dog, are seen in the trailer, which was released five months after the death of Lisa Marie Presley, Elvis' only child. The movie, based on Priscilla's 1985 autobiography Elvis and Me, is scheduled for release in October. It chronicles the story of their early romance, when she was just 14 years old and started corresponding with the singer via pen pal when she was living in Germany and he was in the U.S. Elvis is portrayed by Australian actor Jacob Elordi, who was previously seen in Euphoria, while Priscilla is portrayed by Kaylee Spini, who was previously featured in Mare of East Town. During the 1980s, Elvis' ex-wife, who played the lead in the soap opera Dallas, served as the movie's executive producer. According to the singer's estate, the new biopic was made without their consent or knowledge. Lisa Marie received Graceland, a mansion on a 13.8-acre estate in Memphis, Tennessee, after the rock star died there in 1977 at the age of 42. She was discovered dead in the bathtub. It was passed down to her three daughters after Lisa Marie passed away suddenly in January of this year at the age of just 54. Officials representing the 18-time chart toppers estate have criticized the new biopic, though they haven't publicly discussed it. Coppola's screenplay and directing are deemed horrible by one estate official who attended the movie. They said of the film, it feels like a college movie to the American entertainment website TMZ. The set designs are very appalling, this is not how Graceland appears. The movie will be released in theaters in October, and Priscilla has vowed that viewers would enjoy the journey despite the estate's criticism. I am thrilled with how the brilliant Sofia Coppola will adapt my work. I have always admired her work and think she has such a unique viewpoint. This film will undoubtedly transport everyone on an emotional trip. Coppola has previously recalled reading the memoir a long time ago and being moved by it after recently discussing it with a friend. I read it again, and I was really moved by her story, she remarked. I ran into a few roadblocks, so I just changed course and focused on making one movie with one idea. I really found Priscilla's narrative and her viewpoint on what it was like to grow up as a teenager in such an interesting.